Film Companion, one of India's top media house, the premier platform for Indian cinema with multiple YouTube channels and millions of subscribers has shut down. It is an end of an era. Let's talk. Hello guys, I'm Nona Prince and if you are a viewer of the channel or a consumer of movie reviews on Indian cinema, you would know Film Companion, Film Companion South or other channels, which was owned by the renowned film critic and film journalist Anupama Chopra, which started in the year 2014 and after 10 years, in 24, it has come to an end. In these 10 years, we have not just seen reviews and interviews, but also a community they created for the film enthusiasts with live events, workshops, panels, roundtables, masterclasses and whatnot. If you are a cinephile in India, you might have come across their content at least once. When they started in 2014, which was before the internet boom that happened in India, I remember following their channel since then. And it was one of the most authentic platform discussing, analyzing films and the craft behind it with a lot of passion. Unlike others, which were more interested in the gossips and the sensation even the interviews with the people in front and behind the camera, they were about the filmmaking process, the acting process, and not about their romantic relationships. Even the reviews they put out, you may agree with them or not, but they were very detailed. And it was not just Anupama Chopra, she brought so many other people on the platform with varied opinions. They started with just covering Bollywood and Hollywood, but with the pan India boom, even they diversified. They delved into the cinema of the South and signed a separate channel to cover those films, through which we got BR. Then with the OTT boom, they covered streaming also. They not just covered the big blockbusters, but also the festival films. And with all of this, it was one place for cinephiles. They literally created a film community, which most of us were part of. In the initial days, I was used to be part of the debates happening in the comments, under the reviews, under the interviews, all of us sharing our thoughts. And I will credit them for creating a film culture in India. They taught us how to talk about a film, how to discuss, how to debate, how to break it down. To them, we understood what is film appreciation. And it was film companion who introduced Malayalam cinema to me. I remember when they made a video about Kumbalangi Nights and Virus, which led to me exploring it. And then it was just a never-ending story. And they kept exploring and supporting all the different films from all different regions. And they also celebrated the deserved artists. And it continued across the country. And they even had impact on the film culture, raising issues in the film industry. From the representation of women to the situation of the writers, they raised their questions and even confronted people from the industry in their interviews. They never backed down. Now, this journey had ups and downs. I'm sure we all looked forward to the round tables at the end of the year. They brought so many people together, which we never thought was possible. We got long interviews with legendary filmmakers and actors. But there was also the infamous Befikre review, the Sandeep Reddy Wanga interview, the Kabir Singh review. And there were moments which I was not a fan of. The Star Kids interview talking about stardom and social media, which all felt like a PR exercise. Videos about fashion at Cannes and social media influencers. Maybe there's audience for that. They were again diversifying. But I subscribed to Film Companion and I didn't connect to all of this. But you can still say that they kept experimenting. And Film Companion became a brand that everyone in the industry wanted to come on their show. Anupama Chopra literally brought these critics together and assembled them like Avengers. And they spearheaded the film movement in India. Now, I don't know the reason why they are shutting down. Maybe running a media house without getting into clickbaits or sensationalized content is difficult to run. But what we know is that Anupama Chopra is now moving to the Hollywood Reporter India as their first editor, which is a big deal. The Hollywood Reporter is one of the biggest, you know, media house of Hollywood and they are opening their branch in India, which is a big deal because since RRR, there has been a lot of focus on India. Variety, another big one, constantly talks about Indian cinema, which is actually a good thing. And we may see a lot of faces from Film Companion here, though they'll still continue with the Film Companion studio. And the first project will be the upcoming Netflix documentary on SS Rajamoli. But Film Companion shutting down is definitely sad, but everything comes to an end at some point. That's life and you have to move on. But I will take this opportunity to congratulate the team behind FC, everyone who was part of the 10 year long journey, which made all of us happy. And you can stay happy watching this video where I talked about is this the golden era of Indian cinema. Check it out. Do let me know your thoughts and your memories of FC in the comments below and I will see you next time. Now, should we keep subscribed to all the Film Companion channels? I don't know, but subscribe to this one.